I would like to discuss just a few additional tips about working with your daisy. Now you can see that I have the daisy oriented uh, with the incision transverse. Now the daisy is an acronym for uh, the dog abdominal surrogate for instructional exercises and basically it was designed to um, mimic or be a facsimile of a, um, a ventral abdomen of a, a dog uh, in which you could do the uh, incision and uh, take out a piece of bowel. So that was the design and so in general uh, most of you will end up doing surgery in the ventral abdomen of a dog with the dog or cat or any other species could be a horse oriented in this direction standing either on the, the left or right side of the animal. Um, however, if you were going to do surgery, say, on a dog limb for a fracture repair, a cat limb, um, a horse limb, uh, additionally, if you're going to do arthroscopic surgical procedures on the horse, um, oftentimes the uh, orientation of the uh, body part is like this. So you're standing at the end of the limb. And so it's fair game, really, to use the daisy either in this direction, as it is uh, demonstrated here, or 90 degrees to that, as is demonstrated here. Now, it turns out that um, there is a practical examination in this course, and uh, I can't dictate exactly how the daisy will be oriented. And so you really should be familiar with pra and practice your suturing techniques with the daisy in this orientation and in this orientation, simply to get well-versed and versatile uh, in your uh, um, surgical techniques and in your practice sessions. And so um, there are no rules as far as how the daisy should or could be oriented, say, on the practical examination. And therefore, you probably should become familiar with um, uh, practicing techniques with the daisy either in this direction or 90 degrees in this direction.